As a child, Rivaldo was so poor that he had to walk his frail and bow-legged body nearly 25 kilometers to get to practice. Malnourishment caused him to lose teeth, but his greatest loss was that of his father, who died in a road accident a year before he signed his first pro contract. Ten years later, a rich family in a lavish Paulista villa in Gama gave birth to a boy his brother would later call Kaka because he couldn't pronounce Ricardo. Sao Paulo was his training ground that would eventually lead to international stardom. Rivaldo's had a tough road. 14 teams in just over 20 years with longer stints in Spain and Greece, peppered with shorter ones in Brazil, Italy, Uzbekistan and Angola, a Ballon d'Or with Barcelona, a UEFA Champions League with AC Milan, but also a host of club titles in places the media has left alone. Kaká's approach is more organic. AC Milan paid 8.5 million euros, and while some would make fun of his name, Kaká would silence them by leading the Rossoneri to a Serie A title, the UEFA Champions League, and a FIFA Club World Cup. But his best year was in 2007, when the departure of Andrei Shevchenko liberated Kaká from his midfield role and enabled him to unleash his relentless forward progression and powerful shot. Kaká won the Ballon d'Or, was named FIFA World Player of the Year and seemed destined to be a symbol of the club. But Silvio Berlusconi is a man of business and money talks. The rich kid went to Real for 50 million pounds. It was a long road to acceptance for Rivaldo, who was booed so heavily at times by his compatriots that he threatened to never wear the green and yellow again. But his nation thanked him for doing so in 2002. He led his team to their fifth World Cup triumph in what was a truly defining moment. His ability to shine amongst diamonds, leading coach Luis Felipe Scolari to name him the best player in the tournament. That was despite a ridiculous act when a ball hit him in the thigh and the pain magically transferred to his face. Turkey's Hakan Unsal was left with a red card and Rivaldo was left as the poster boy for diving. Twice voted his country's sexiest footballer, Kaka is married to his childhood sweetheart Caroline and has two children. He's modeled for Armani and Adidas, been on video game covers and was named an ambassador against hunger for the UN's World Food Programme. Rivaldo has opened an evangelical church and is investing his salary in humanitarian initiatives. He's the president of Mogi Mirim, his poor childhood team, and dreams of ending his career back in the favelas he ran away from as a kid. Kaká the rich kid is the Brazilian Beckham, but Rivaldo has done all his talking on the pitch.